Okay, it's so what you strap in episode is a thirteen, and uh, yep, again, golden solar tuna, SNE four ninety eight. This time on a black with yellow center stripe, NATO. Um, it's not quite gold as in metallic gold like the watch, but kind of works. Close enough in theme. Again, I wish the hardware was. Uh, black DLC, uh, probably it's a better match, but you know, it's uh, it's all right. It's nice and flat on the wrist, close, really a 45, actually 46, just a little over 46 millimeter round watch, and the look to look isn't that far off either. Uh, and it underhangs. The, the bottom of the, uh, the case, you know, that's why it just wears so well. <clears throat> so don't be afraid to wear something that's like over 40 millimeters, or whatever. And it's supposed to be big, and they do get even bigger than this, and they are still actually wearable despite going up to 48, maybe 50, or just over that with some of them. With the uh, deeper, di you know, higher water resistant tunas uh, that go up to 1,000 meters. Um, but they're still, you know, they're tool watches and they, they just have a way of making these things fit and wear great on the wrist regardless. And, uh, yeah, so this would be pretty quick, nothing much. It should have been mostly about straps anyways on, on, and the watch check, wrist watch check. So that's what it is. See you on Thursday.